Hi everyone, welcome back to Vedic Life Coaching. I've just been working on a chart for one of you guys and it occurred to me that there's a very simple and very quick way to see if someone's life is going to be enjoyable and or easy, right? And what is the quick way to see if someone's going to have a good life or not? And it occurred to me that there is a very quick way of seeing this. Does the person have a good sun? Does the person have a good moon? If you've got a good moon, good sun, you can do a lot with that. And what do I mean by that? Well, here's another way of expressing that. If you've got a good sun, you likely had a good dad. If you have a good moon, you likely had a good mum, right? So what if you're hearing this and you go, oh no, but my sun is compromised or my moon is compromised or you know these planets have problems in my chart. That's good too because that would force you, that would be a challenge in your chart, a karmic challenge in your chart to strengthen yourself and to work harder and to you know, cultivate your inner self more, you'll have to learn how to become your own father or your own mother. You'll have to parent yourself, hence the world of self-development, right? And some of the strongest and best people in the world have overcome the challenges of their sun and moon. So I just wanted to share that very tiny point with you. It's going to be a small video, it's a couple of minutes. I'll do that from time to time. When I'm working on a chart and if I'm dealing with something and I discover, yeah, you know what, this is a really neat little hack or quick way of looking at something, then I will just share that with you. So the next time you look at your chart, take a look at sun, take a look at moon, and take a look at mum and dad, take a look at dad and mum, right? And take a look at your life through that lens, in that context. And remember, it's never a bad thing if you've got a challenging planet because then that's your obstacle. That's the thing that you've come to work on. Those are the muscles you've come to build. That's what you've come to strengthen up. That's what you've come to do. So nothing is ever a problem, but it's always great to have an explanation for why life has turned out the way it has. You know, It's not like we're looking to blame the planets, but it is really good for the mind to have a reason. Sometimes that's very freeing and in that freeing process we get a bit of healing as well. So I hope this little tip helps you and please remember to like, please remember to subscribe and I look forward to seeing you next time.